Hello, hey lions. Mushrooms are pretty useful in Breath of the Wild. You can make a pretty good meal with them, you need them for a side quest, and you need them to upgrade some gear. Let's find out exactly what you need them for and where to find them. I'm Nico, and this series is all about mushrooms. Some are useful and some are almost useless, but they all have their place in Breath of the Wild. Like my fruit series, we'll learn what they're used for and where to find them. Basically, it's the second half of your first material page. You could look this all up yourself, but I did the research for you. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up, and if you want more Zelda content, I hope you consider subscribing or at least checking out the channel. First, with cooking mushrooms, they're used for speed boost. Cooking them alone won't get you to level 3, but cooking one of them with 3 swift violets or fleet lotus seeds will get you to level 3, and of course, throwing a dragon horn will make that level 3 speed boost last for 30 minutes. The side quest that needs mushrooms is in the Gerudo Canyon stable. A man there will give you a diamond if you give him 55 mushrooms. There are about 10 mushrooms in that area. After receiving a diamond, you give him 55 again and he will give you 330 rupees. That is more than selling anywhere else, but if you want more rupees, you can always watch the video where I compare all the rupee farming methods. Check the card in the corner or the link in the description. And the final thing you need mushrooms for is to upgrade gear. The sand boots and the snow boots both need 15 to upgrade them to level 3, and 9 mushrooms are needed to upgrade all climbers gear to the first level. Now for finding mushrooms, it's actually not easy to find a great place to farm them. Mushrooms are found all over Hyrule, but there are a few locations I've chosen, and having a decent bow and arrows will help. The first location is the shrine from the Perfect Drink side quest. Travel there and you can quickly grab 9 of them. Staying in the Gerudo Desert, if you go to the northwest region, you'll find some along the walls. Use a bow and arrow to knock them down and you can get about 20. This is a decent place to collect some warm safflinas and some Lazolfo's tails. If you go to the shrine west in the Gerudo Highlands, you'll find some mushrooms close to the shrine. And a short trip northwest up the updrafts, you can find more than 20. You can also find some butterflies, darners, rahul birds, and farouche. Of course, you can go to Satori Mountain. There's two spots here, just north of the mushroom tree where you can find more than 10, then go north and you can find about 10 more. And of course, in every video I mention Satori because you can get almost every material here. And finally, the Thunder Plateau. They're along the northern and western walls. Use a bow to knock them down and you can get more than 40. And of course, Thunder Plateau surprisingly has many other materials like swift violets, butterflies, octorox, and many more. After you upgrade your gear, you can use mushrooms for speed dishes, and that's basically it. I hope this helped, and if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you want more Zelda content, I hope you consider subscribing. Razor Shrooms are next. See you next time.